one young lady that came to mind, she finished grade 12, 2020, has severe social anxiety, which manifested into selective mutism. And she came to me very nonverbal. And dad was just beside himself. He couldn't get her out of her room. And he just didn't know what to do anymore, sort of at his wits end. It took a lot to try to get her to trust me um, and become comfortable in in this environment because I found that when she was comfortable if you asked her a question she would enthusiastically give you a response but she would never volunteer information but it took a, a while to get to that point initially she just wouldn't answer me at all so I've got to be honest, I had to do some research on that one and because I hadn't come across, you know, that specific uh, selective mutism before. We put her into the PATH program. I wasn't sure how she was going to go because she's this quiet little thing and she was in this group with, I think it was like half a dozen guys. But within a week she was, I actually heard her laughing and it was beautiful. <laughs> she was just so lovely. I worked together with her and the PATH um, facilitator and we put her into a data entry job in an insurance broker and she's just hit four months, which is amazing. <laughs> and she's still quite nonverbal at times, but that's okay. Um, she's enjoying the job, learning lots of new things. You know, she works every day. And for someone six months ago who her dad couldn't get her out of her bedroom, I look, I just makes makes me warm and fuzzy. I think that's that's a beautiful thing. For someone that age, show her that there's a whole different world out there. We pushed her out of a comfort zone. I think the outcome has been amazing. And she's very happy. So and so's dad. <laughs>